All right, what up, what up? How are we doing? Oh, I forgot to set my uh, thing. Uh, one second. Forgot to edit my YouTube description. Oopsies. All right, what up? How are we doing today? I just realized I need to learn Melee Virago now. That's going to be such a mess. I need to make all this Abyssal Flesh. I forgot to make it the other night. Oh, that reminds me. I think I need to put Abyssal uh, Spikes on my Carapac page. I don't have it on my Carapac page. Now the question is, do I remember how to use melee? That's going to be the big question. Or do I, do I remember what I learned yesterday? Okay. Definitely need to put abyssal spikes on this page. Listen, I kind of figured some stuff out. So let me start the instant so I can quick join. Like, I'm not saying I'm a melee god or anything, but... I, I, I know a thing or two. Big damage already. Wait, what happened to all my damage? What? Do not let you him the shadow. You hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. Like, look, it knows. It looks like I know what I'm doing. Isn't this exciting? Oh, 
Okay, no, never mind. It doesn't look like I know what I'm doing at all. Wait, I didn't do any damage. What? Why didn't I do any damage? <laughs> Wait a second. Why? Why didn't I do any damage? Hello? Okay, hold on. Don't, don't look at that. I'm actually so confused why I didn't do any damage there. Hmm. Oh, you know what? Normally I do a blood assault at the beginning of P3 and I didn't do it there. That probably is why I didn't do any damage. Okay, I'm playing serious now. No, no more games. Oh, you know what? I just realized I didn't equip my offhand. I see. I understand now. I understand everything. What's going on? How are we doing? The floor has been interrupted. He is roused. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. Okay, this time I'm gonna equip my offhand. I think that's gonna be the, the attack here. The shadow grows thicker. You must defeat him quickly. Oh yeah. Now we're cooking. Wait, that that was kind of hot though. You must finish him quickly. The secondary defenses will not hold for long. Yeah, yeah, I tsunami for the for the crit buff. Uh what armor do you have? I have uh vestments of havoc on. So now we wait for Greater Barge again. Wait, I just didn't barge. What? Wait, why did I do that? Why oh, I, I didn't escape there. Oopsies. Wait, why isn't my escape working? Oh, I surged. I didn't even realize I surged. I'm bad. That's fine. I totally deserve that. That phase one through three, that was pretty clean, though. What was not clean was... Uh, surging and then forgetting that I surged. That was that was pretty bad. But yeah, with the crit buff, this seems like really really consistent. Um, yeah, so that's why I've been using it. You may think 
you hear it speaking, ignore it and focus. Um, it's not really hybrid. I'm using magic for tsunami and then getting off of it. So like here I'm using tsunami and then I'm getting back on melee. Like, that's kind of clean, though. You must finish him quickly. The secondary defenses will not hold for long. I should have barged there. Dude, this is so sick. Melee is so sick. Well done. I will return Raksha to his confinement. But yeah, basically the crit buff is really important for just keeping your adrenaline as high as possible. But melee doesn't have easy access to the crit buff. So if I were to do it with Meteor Strike, it would cost 60 adrenaline. Technically, it would cost less because I would get 20% back immediately or I would regenerate 15. So it costs like 45 adrenaline or I can use Tsunami for or I can use magic for four abilities and have it cost. Well, have it generate seven adrenaline basically, right? Because I have to use three, three basics, which is 24 adrenaline or 20, 27, I think. And then the tsunami only costs 20. So instead of spending all of that adrenaline, I can just generate it instead. This damage is just so insane. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. Um, there is upside to trying to use Meteor Strike. It's just going to depend on your crit RNG. Instead, you can do like that, just all being guaranteed. 
is uh because like I'm on a little bit of a time limit, and that's the big issue with just using a meteor strike. Is that you don't want to you don't want to like use meteor strike, and then you low roll on crits, and now it's taking too too long. So like that's kind of the balancing act that I'm thinking about. But yeah, like you, you saw there that the crit RNG, it's like, it's just a lot safer with Tsunami. Because basically what you can do is at like 50 adrenaline. So let me spend my adrenaline. Uh, so what you can do is, you know, at 50 adrenaline, you're going to use your, your three abilities. So we started with 45 adrenaline. And then we sue Tsunami, and we end with 55. So we gained 10 Adrenaline by just getting a crit buff. Whereas, so that took four abilities. If you Meteor Strike, you need Meteor Strike and two of your other abilities to crit to get the same uh, ad Adrenaline. It's just not worth it. Or it's not worth the risk. Like, if your goal is is to high roll, then, like, that's kind of defeating the purpose, you know? Like, maybe if you're uh, speed killing and you're trying to get the most possible damage, that, that wouldn't be bad. Yeah, I think that big numbers are just really sick. So that's why melee is the best combat style. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. Yeah, yeah, like if you're like, yeah. Because I don't like pre-building. I think pre-building's cringe. But if you don't mind pre-building, then you're definitely just going to pre-build. That's annoying. Doesn't matter, but that's still annoying. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, physicist, for the follow. Appreciate it. Yeah, basically, you're just removing as much of the variance as you can. Uh, Necro did not get nerfed heavily. If you feel like Necro is way worse, then you're doing something differently. Or whatever you were doing was inconsistent to begin with.
Oh, I was berserked, so I just took 45 million damage from that. That's good. So that's crit damage. Well and yes, it did lose crit crit damage, but like that's not that looks worse than it is. So like additively, it's minus 25% crit damage, but multiplicatively, it's like minus 14%. Then you also have to consider you're not always critting, right? What's going on, James? How are we doing? So you're only losing damage on your crits. And then Grimoire just isn't very good for Necromancy. You basically only use it at Solak and Virago. And honestly, it might be kind of fake at Solak. True. Yeah, so if, if you always crit, yeah, then you're going to be getting like a 15% damage reduction. But the only time I always crit is when I'm in my arm and all battle staff, which, as some of you may know, is not necromancy. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. Um, I don't know if Jazz Book is always better. It's just that Necro doesn't need super crazy crits in order to do the Necro thing. There are very few bosses where you're going to notice, like, not having ultra crazy crits. Yeah, full book is also disgusting. Full book is very, very, very powerful. And it costs not literally nothing because there is technically a, G a GP cost but it costs basically nothing to run. Dude, melee is so cool. Yeah, I have like 1.3k full full book pages. And even if I didn't, if I were to buy 1.3k full book pages, I think that would cost me like 15 mil, right? How much is this? Or is it 20 mil now? Yeah, this is what? Like seven, like 800 hours of full book. And it costs 20 mil. So if you have a full book, just use it. Yeah, it turns out when it's basically free to run, why not run it? Also, I haven't been using darkness this entire time.
So the only thing to be aware of with full book is there are bosses where the extra damage you take is going to get you, you killed. Right now, that is sometimes Rassiel and definitely Vorkath. I would imagine at decently high in raid Zamrock, then you're going to feel it as well. What's going on, Roadmap? How we doing? Like, how insane is that damage? Yeah, I, like, figured it out. I don't know what happened between today and yesterday, but I'm kind of a genius now. You almost can't tell I've been using melee for a total of like eight hours. Once you learn, yeah, melee is really, really fun. Just the damage is so crazy. What's your Raksha KC? Like 3.4K at this point? Oh, let me see. Yeah, almost 3.5K. I would say about... 3,100 of that is with ranged. What's going on, Mr. Brick? I have a mastered melee. Melee Zuck Nut next? Absolutely not. That sounds like the least fun I've ever had. Maybe for like a challenge, but even for a challenge, that sounds horrible. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. Awesome, mate. Dude, I'm telling you, people keep telling me that Vorkath is bad money. I'm like, dude, Vorkath money is crazy right now. Yeah, hard mode Vorkath right now is like, what, 110, 120 mil an hour? You must finish him quickly. 
the secondary defenses will not hold for long. Assuming you're getting 15 kills an hour. Can melee uh one hit um can melee one hit Zemergul? Oh, that was just not correct. Okay, Chaos Roar Claws. That was a okay damage. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. What's going on, Pupuma? How we doing? Yeah, range is just so disgustingly broken. But, um... I don't know. I don't find range to be very fun. see main hand. What the heck? Thanks, Romata, for the sub. I appreciate it. Yeah, I don't know what it is about range, but it just doesn't work for, for for me. Nice, that's awesome. I appreciate the support. Oh wait, I forgot my uh thing. <clears throat> I think I'm just really dumb, so like Melee is really big, big numbers. That's just working for me right now. Like when I see a bunch of 15k plus hits, I'm like, yeah, this is the good stuff. Like, how is this not the best style? Oops, I completely trolled. Yeah, it turns out bigger number is more better. This is going to be slightly disastrous. You must defeat him quickly. Is what I would say. Oh yeah. Yeah, you you rapid fire and then you just have infinite adrenaline for your next three abilities. It's pretty nice. I completely disagree that that hit me, but all right. I could not disagree more with what I just witnessed. Like, dude, this damage is so cool. Getting 19 to 20 kills now. Yeah, if you're getting 20 kills an hour at Vorkath, oh my god, that money is so disgusting. That's got to be like, what, 150 mil an hour?
Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me if it was more. Because, like, I'm way above drop rate on spikes. So, like, my time at Vorkath is currently worth, like, 180 mil an hour. But, like, that's getting 15 kills an hour. I think my drop rate on spikes is like 1 in 11 or something. The flow has been interrupted. He is roused. Yeah, bigger numbers more better. You may think it's just you so clear. Speaking. Ignore it and focus. Yeah, one in fifteen. The shadow goes thicker. You must defeat him quickly. It's too dangerous. Like. <laughs> Dude, this damage is so sick. Like, I just lured my dad to Wildy and killed him for 40 bill. He's pissed. What do I do? Um, uh, first, you, you tell him sit. And then you tell him you'll give him back half of it if you don't have to do chores, like, ever again. And then if he doesn't take your threat seriously, <laughs> you know what to do. Exactly true. Be like every hour that 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 goes by that you don't Say no more chores. I'm doing a one bill drop party. Good luck, King. Yeah, that's like really disgusting GP per hour. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Chris, for the follow. Can you imagine you? <laughs> Oh, you hack your dad's account and then you're just like, hey, uh, I saw this guy running around with a party hat. It was super interesting. If only uh, we, we could do something about that. I think it was your party hat, actually. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it. I think I can do another ability there, but I'd rather not get hit and take damage. So.
<laughs> yeah, it's like, hey, daddy, remember that time you, you grounded me? <laughs> How's it feel? But I've never forgiven you. Dude, Fury's sick. Oh, I like have to hit him now. I forgot that melee like cues your abilities now. It's like super weird. Yeah, I mean, Necro's really nuts. Necro's really, really good. I'm also like remembering to use Fury before my my good abilities. So it's definitely making it a lot stronger. Yeah, melee feels really, really good. I also don't use melee, so like I'm sure I can get these kills way faster than what they are now. Yeah, the damage is really, really crazy. I mean, I basically use punish off cooldown once he's below half. Before he's below half, it's like not really worth using. So in, in phase four, I like slam it, but like before phase four, it's not worth doing. Like you use it once in the phase three transition. But normally my phase three is Berserk, Barge, Fury, Overpower, Blood Assault, Hurricane Claws, or uh. Lang's claws. If he's not dead, then I'll use punish, but he's usually dead by then. Well, I also have max gear. So like Seven max minutes. gear definitely helps Seven a lot. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks Elias for the follow, appreciate it. Like, you can still kill Raksha without max gear, but, like, doing it relatively quickly, you definitely need some pretty insane gear. The flow has been interrupted. He is roused. The crits, they're too powerful. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it. Uh, not today, but I'm a little bit over drop rate on Ricochet, so if I don't get one for a couple months, that wouldn't surprise me. Wait, no, what did I do? Oh, I, I just trolled. I don't know what I just did. Oh, actually, hold on. Let, let, let me think. What keybinds did I just press? I press shift two and shift one. Oh, I see. Okay. I, I know. I know what I did. Okay. I know what I did.
I mean, melee is obviously way stronger. Um, I don't know, like, what stronger is going to mean there, but it's, it's definitely better. Uh, so I, I'm using Zuck Sword. It's just, it's a bleed. So the best way to use it is inside of your Essence of Finality. And you, you use its spec while wielding a Masterwork Spear. Well, melee is the best way to kill Virago anyways, because during, um, during Vitalis, you can just pray melee and devotion and still build adrenaline while killing Vitz. So you don't have to, um, you don't have to barricade if you were going to tank Vitalis. And then just during Reflex, you can just devotion and just keep hitting him. The issue is you can't use any bleeds because if you use a single bleed, like you one tick switch to magic and just die. So that's like the issue. Yeah, you have a lot more flexibility with how you deal with re with uh, reflex, which is nice. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. Yeah, Lang spec does feel really good. The only thing I don't love about it is how much RNG there is. Like, sometimes you just get all of the stacks, and then other times you have no stacks, and it just sucks. It's too dangerous. I'll open the gates. No, it's like, I was hitting him a lot there, and I had two stacks. And then there are times where... Um, like, I'll be in that same thing, and I'll have six stacks, and it's like, oh, well, this is really crazy. Like, it's just, what, a guarantee to, like, 45k or something? Okay, but how crazy was that, though? Wait, that was kind of sick, what I just did there. Wait, that was cracked, though. My clicks were kind of insane. Like, I escaped, bladed dive, same tick. Used Limitless, Blood Assault. Like, I'm kind of crazy for that one. Yeah, the damage is really crazy. What's going on, Jimmy? Like, I I'm kind of crazy for that one. I was in Ultra Instinct for, for a second. That was nuts. The 
The flow has been interrupted. He is roused. Like, like this damage is just so insane. You may think you hear it speaking. Ignore it and focus. I'm sure it's worth using somewhere. I don't really know where it'd be worth using, but I'm sure it's worth using somewhere. What's going on, John? How are we doing? Bro, are demos even a thing anymore? I thought they got rid of those. The crazy thing about Capcom they know how to make a good game and sometimes they just choose not to like how crazy is that that sometimes capcom's like yeah we're we're good yeah i took the sign there i wanted to get my uh destroy off so i just accepted the the, the sign Oh, but I'm kind of good at melee now. Like, I'm kind of nasty with it. Be honest. Okay, so let's relog and get a Reaper task. I'm gonna pick Carapac, and then we're gonna learn melee Carapac. Is Twitch broken? Wait, what'd you do? Wait, what? Wait, get scammed. Oh, I forgot to claim my daily yesterday. I definitely did it, but I forgot to claim it. Uh, let's do my... MTX stoked to try BBC main hand. What the heck? Thanks, Silver, for the follow or for the sub. I appreciate it. Says subscription available on the 8th. It might be like later today or something. I'm level 97. Wait, what? I forgot that this promo you like to keep whatever level your character is across promotions. It's so funny. It's hilarious every single time. Bro, Twitch is some scammers. Ooh, a little death touch dart. Okay. More aura refreshes. Soul Reaper refresh. We'll take that. Wait, what? Why is it doing this? Oh, I misclicked overview. I see. It resets at the end of the year. Interesting. I'd love to use the new styles for everything. Um, 
Yeah, I mean, I put out something for budget gear, so I would look into that first. Because, like, obviously at the top end, all of the synergies come together to make something really cool and really awesome. But you don't need that. Oh, let me get a Reaper. Oh, that, that reminds me. I'm a Mercher now. I'm buying a Hydrix to hold on to. Uh, these should be like 50 mil. I'd be super surprised. Yeah, I'll just hold on to these. <clears throat> well, yeah, best in slot Necro is going to be better than everything you have for a very long time. But that's also like the good thing about this game is that there's just there's always more ways to like explore the content in, in the game. What's going on, John? How we doing? Um, why did I come into my bank? Reaper task. Yeah, the damage is pretty nuts. So I haven't done any care pack yet. I have an idea of what I'd want to do, but I haven't actually done it yet. So we'll see how it ends up going. Oh, let me start an instance so I can do the thing. Go do some Vorky. Stoked to try BBC main hand. What the heck? And there it is. Thanks, John, for the sub. Appreciate it. Okay. So, let's put Berserk back on. Uh, I like melee a lot. Melee is a lot of fun. No, I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Oh, I did the thing wrong. Oops. Whatever. You will break beneath me.
The time threads have split. I totally forgot to use my wings. I definitely should have been using my Lang spec. I just totally forgot. Stoked to try BBC main hand. What the heck? Thanks, Luco, for the sub. I appreciate it. Okay, so the thing that I'm not sure about is phase four. So we'll see how this goes. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time. Wait, why didn't I attack this? I just trolled. I, I don't know what I just did. Don't look at that. I am so lost. <laughs> okay. So we'll do this. Mega Slam. Barge you. Do this. Claws. Thanks, John, for the gifted. Okay. Well, I have ruined the kill. I have to teleport. Yeah, I'm not used to the last phase meet my guy not just auto-targeting the uh, the clone across from him. So that's something I need to get used to. Okay. So my meleeers. What's going on? How are we doing? So what are we doing in P4? Because I know that there's a way to be in Berserk and in Devotion the entire phase. I obviously just don't know what it is, right? Thanks, Vic. I appreciate it. Yeah, the Raksha has been really, really fun. Wait, was my Grimoire off that entire time? No way it was off that entire time. Okay, well, obviously, that's why I wasn't doing any damage. So my Grimoire was off. Yeah, now we're trying to figure out Karapak. So we'll see how this ends up going. Oh, I need to be using my ZGS. I brought my ZGS and just didn't use it. So now we do a little bleed rotation. You will break beneath me. Now we do this. And now we do this. And then we lang spec because I'm not sure I can do this. No, I 
control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Okay, then we'll cash for a quaz. You will break beneath me. Okay, then we'll bleed an assault. I don't think I need the lang spec here. I'm gonna do it. I'm I'm insecure. I'm gonna lang spec. Thanks, Luco, for the gifted. Appreciate it. Like, how insane is this damage, though? I will put you in your place. I get this. Witness the raw power. I don't get this. Look at what you've done. Wait, what? Oh, that spawned on me. I see. I understand. I understand. I have I have brain damage. I understand. I thought I was fine there. Was not fine at all. Thanks, Nate, for the gifted. Appreciate it. Okay. We need to lock in. This phase four is beating my ass right now. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Ascension Bolts, for the follow. Appreciate it. going on how we doing no always you why can't you just let it be world guardian i'll tear right through you oh i griefed by using dismember hmm I think we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. Nice. I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Oh, I did the thing again.
Dude, melee's damage is so sick. I'm having so much fun with melee. Dude, Elden Ring is gonna be so evil. I no. I can contain all its power. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Dude, what is this damage like? Okay, I need to figure out how to play the game now. Okay. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time. Wait, that's so bad. Oh my god. I thought I had more time. I'm just gonna barricade. I don't feel like... I don't feel like doing this. Oh! Instantly dead. Oh my god, this phase four is like, I'm like not, I'm not doing it right. I'm doing so, something wrong. I think I'm using my dive too aggressively. Because I need to dive onto the third uh, dude. Okay. I don't know if there's any game I've played that much. Actually, hold on. Is that true? I've played Resident Evil 4 seven times, including uh, separate ways. Five times uh, excluding it. What's going on, Fate? How we doing? Um, I wouldn't consider MMOs that. I, I think that those are meaningfully different. Yeah, I've played Resident Evil 4 that much. I've played Cyberpunk pretty close to that much. I've done four playthroughs. Maybe five. Melee's been really fun. I've been enjoying it. Honestly, I kind of just want to like hop back on and finish uh, all the main story stuff. No, always you. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. you in your 
your place. Wait, what? What is wrong with me? Okay, that was completely psychotic. Don't don't do that. Okay, we 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 fixed it. That was really bad though. The threads of time. The time threads have split. Like how nuts is that damage though? Put you in your place. What's going on, Void? How we doing? Yeah, melee looks so crazy. Like I'm having so much fun with it. Wait, why did that kill me? What? Wait, I'm pissed. I'm still fine, it doesn't matter, but I'm pissed. All its power. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. This is just such an insane amount of damage. You will break beneath me. Okay, I need to go over here. Yeah, the the big crits are just really nuts. Okay. Look at what you've done. Up in Fractured this body. Of time. Up in this body. Power burst. Hop back in this body. We wait for barge. Barge. Bleed assault. G Fury, Overpower, Devotion, use that, wait why aren't you dead, what? Oh, I am dead again, goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah, I signed early and then I just didn't know what, what, what to do. Um, okay. So let me just think about the last phase for, for a second. Let me think. So on the first body, I hop in. So I hop in the first body. I time warp Berserk. So ideally, I shouldn't need Reflect because if I do it properly, I should be under Devotion and Berserk for the entire phase. I'm just not doing it properly. So I just need to like, think about it for, uh, for a second. Okay, I am banning you, cause if you were paying attention, then you would notice that that's what I've literally been doing, but you're not watching, so you're just typing, so I'm just banning you.
Bye, have fun. Okay. So I wait for barge. I time warp. Devotion. Barge. Hold on, I'm having a stroke. Seven minutes. Hold on. Seven minutes is all I can say. I need to think to about it. You. Thanks, Pep Pep Lag for the follow. Appreciate it. Okay. I just need to think. Okay. Because I don't have that much time to use Seven that minutes. many abilities. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, August, for the follow. Oh, yeah. I mean, if you want to get in the uh, YouTube chat, you can ban people that can't read or that don't know what they're watching. Because literally every single time I got to P4, I jumped in the body or I jumped in the body for the, the full heal. I time warp, berserked, jumped in the other body, and um, power bursted. I did that literally every single time. Okay, so I have five abilities that I can use. So I'm, I'm writing it down in my notepad. Okay, I have five abilities that, that, that I can use. So I want to zerk into barge into fury into overpower and then I need a one tick hop in the last body bleed assault and power burst and hop back to the first body That's not happening. There's a break TOS if I talk to myself. No, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. I've been I did a few ratchet kills earlier in the stream. They they went pretty well. I think I only messed up one one kill. Okay, so if I Zerk a barge greater fury overpower hop into the last hop into the second clone. Same tick Power burst. Or maybe, okay. So what if I just go in the second body, power burst, then hop in the first body? Does, do, does that work? If I just power burst one body, then hop in the first one and then do the rotation? Okay. Oh yeah, okay, let me see if I can mod you from, from here or if I need to do anything crazy. Okay, I need to go into my YouTube chat so I can mod you. Okay, let me hop in my YouTube chat real, real quick. If you're think Okay. So I should be able to mod you from here, add as moderator. can manage blocked words and change chat modes in live. Oh, that's sick. So whenever a bunch of racists start coming in, you can change it to like subscriber only mode or something. True. All right, Hope, I've given you a lot of power. Do not abuse it. What's going on, Pillow? How, how we doing? Okay, so I hop in middle body. I power burst middle body. Then I berserk, barge, greater fury, Seven minutes. overpower. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Pillow, for the follow. Appreciate it. I'm doing okay. I'm trying to learn Melee Carapack, and it's hurting my brain. So I just need to, like, think th through it and then do the thing that I'm thinking. I don't know. You, you do chat's crazy. There's a lot of people that just can't read. I banned some guy in YouTube chat like um, a, a month ago because um, I was killing Glacor and I died to invisible beams and he was like, 
Yeah, you're bad for dying there. I'm like, oh yeah, you're right. My 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 bad. I don't thanks Kasharm for the sub. Appreciate it. I mean, John is pretty prominent. Yeah, it's like, my bad for dying to invisible beams. He's like, you could have done something. It's like... You're right. It's all good. He got that quick ban, so... Huh, don't care. Okay. So I hop in middle body. I power burst. I go back to real body. Zerk, Barge, Greater Fury, Overpower, Blood Assault. Then after the Blood Assault, I'll snap and get all of my Adrenaline back. So then I Devotion and go to the... And then I Bladed Dive the third body and blow that guy up. Will you be doing any range at some point? I've been really enjoying Melee, so that's what we've been focusing on. Okay. All right. I think I have an idea of what we're, we're going to do. And then if I do all of that right. What's going on, EEO? How we doing? I'm currently getting obliterated at Carapac. But I'm doing a lot of damage. So, like, that's kind of sick. Yep, I just re reset it. Okay. It's time to put my theory into practice. Our tier 85 length. Oh, sorry. I thought I answered that. Uh, yeah, if you don't have tier 95 uh, langs, tier 85s are your best options. Blood Assault, we'll destroy, tear right through you. walk under, bleed rotation, I will put you in your ZGS, now we're just going to hit him, and then we're going to wait. And we'll walk here, we'll barge, flurry, then we'll walk out, walk back on again, and then just hit him now. Okay, I'm not confident I'm going to kill him, so I will use my langs. Okay, perfect. I control the threads of time. Okay, so now we use just any ability, Greater Fury, Overpower, I should have used Claws. Okay, so now we Barge, Greater Fury, Overpower, Assault, Wangs, Chaos Roar, Claws. Okay. That was the most disgusting damage I've ever seen in my entire life. Okay. Now we just barge, use a bleed, and then hit him. Okay. Now we just do that exact same thing. We claws here because they're free. Right through you. Wait, what's the cooldown on my barge? Okay, never mind. My barge is back. Yeah, I don't have Chaos War for my claws, so we're just going to use them. You will break beneath me. We're going to go over here so I don't have to worry about the melee slams.
We'll use Langs here just to make sure we get our damage out. Okay. Look at what you Hop done. in this body. You fractured the Power burst. Hop in this body. We hit this guy. Okay, we overpower. Claws. Okay, so now we leave. We go here. Okay, we devotion. Do this. Uh, do this. Use claws. We blast this guy. Wait, where did this clone go? Did this clone actually ju ju just die? Wait, where did that clone go? Does that clone just die that fast because he, he's melee? Can you mod if, can you mod me? F um, maybe. Like, Hope's been doing it for, for a while and he's pretty good at it, so I don't mind letting him do it. Okay. So, does that clone just insta-die because he's a melee clone instead of, like, a ranged clone or something? Like, is that a, a thing? Because I expected him to live significantly longer than that. Yeah, maybe. Oh, so like as soon as all of your adrenaline comes back. Oh, I see. So as soon as all of your adrenaline comes back, you go to the the buffed up one. Okay. Okay. I understand. Okay. Let's let's try that. You trust me with your life? True. I mean, I'm pretty harmless, so I think that's totally valid. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. Wait, that that walk under was clutch. Okay, and then we'll langs. And then we'll hit the guy. I control the threads I mean we're 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 doing big damage and that's all that matters. So here I'm about to slam this guy with the might of a thousand suns. Okay, never mind, I just ruined the entire game. Um Okay, I'm teleporting. <laughs> uh, yeah, I can ruin the game there. I'll be completely honest. That was not good. Don't do not do that. Like, with Necromancy, you can mess up Rift Skip, and it's fine. If you mess it up with Melee, it feels so cursed. Okay, we're making progress, though. We're making progress. I I can feel the gears turning. Oh, I just grieved. Okay, never mind. We, we lose. I'll tear right through you. I 
I mean, that's that's completely fair. I think that's, that's I think that's honest. That's fair. Or claws now. I will put you in your place. Okay, we'll wait a second. Use Langs. Hit the guy. Wait, where, where's my damage? Wait, what? I have to barricade. Well, that sucked. Oh my god, I forgot that I'm Berserk. I'm like, why is this doing so much damage to me? Make it make sense. Oops, I messed up again. Well, looks like we have to barricade again. You've done. You fractured the threads of time. God damn it. Okay, well, we'll hit him with a little debilitate action. Hit him with a little reflect action. We'll build up to a hundred. And then we'll cave. Okay, we're safe. I think. Wait, no, we're not safe. Wait, no, we're we're safe. We're safe. We're safe. <laughs> I get to devotion again. Okay, that P four was so bad, but we did get the kill. Melee is the best combat style again? Uh, no. 
Why no darkness? I died and my darkness went off. Normally I would have it on, but I died in the bed. <clears throat> yeah, range is the best style right now. Okay. Um, it's probably Grimoire Locked, but I haven't tried it without Grimoire, so I, I, I don't really know. I don't know about that, but we'll, we'll see. Once I get the clean P4s, then I'll be able to say that. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? Right now, my P4s are pretty suspect. So can I just full channel this and like walk under him and keep channeling it? Oh, that, okay. I didn't know that you could do that. Nah, that's kind of nuts though. I didn't know that you could do that. Hell no, this is a no duo zone. Yeah, yeah, you should start at zero. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. I should have used G Fury there, but it's fine. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time. No, I meant to hop in this body. Oh my god, that was so bad. That was... I actually, like, had it. I had it. Oh my god, I had it. Okay. I was trying to hop in the body and I kept misclicking. No need for Jaws. Um, I haven't found there to be like crazy adrenaline issues. So personally, I would just stay away from, from Jaws, but it, it could be fine. I actually had it there. That's so sad. <clears throat> um... 
generally speaking for normal mode until you have max gear i would say just do what you can to uh kill all of the giants that way the fight is like as simple as it can be without max gear it's going to be really hard to like insanely speed up your your kill time so that's just what i would say Oh, that's so bad. Okay, I need to reset. But yeah, generally, you can just soul split Vorkath until the end. You don't need to do anything like super crazy. No, always you. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I, I think I'll be fine. Like, I'm not worried about how long this is going to take. I have all the time in the world, so... I just didn't do the right thing at all. I totally griefed my rotation. I will put you in your place. Um, I need to fix it somehow. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Nino, for the follow. Appreciate it. I think I need to overpower and then use Lang spec and then use claws and that didn't do anything so we're just dead. Okay. We're dead. See the five man team that did 27,000 raid. Yeah, I mean the Zamrock pushers like it's just kind of, kind of nuts. They have the fight, like, so memorized that I feel like the enrage just doesn't matter anymore. It's, like, really, really crazy how good they are.
Personally, I have no desire to do stuff like that, but it is really cool that people can do that. No, always you. Yeah, I'm not using Masterwork. Just let it be world guardian. No thanks. I need the lightning spike here, unfortunately. I didn't want to, but I don't have a choice. No, I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Greater Fury Claws, try to get as much damage as we can. Put you in your place. I mean, the warning's hard, so like this is gonna take a while, and I I, I know that I'm not not like worried about it. The tide threads have split. I'll tear right through you. There we go. Now we can just build up to 100 adrenaline. That was the first time I like did the rotation properly. Okay. So, hop in this body. Power burst. Hop in this body. Back. Then we do this. No we devotion. No we claws. Okay, and then we go here. Then we build up to a hundred. Oh, we don't actually have time to build up to it to a hundred, honestly. Yeah, I'm like close. I know I'm close. I'm just not quite there yet. And there it is. Hit him with the double claw spec.
So I got the first two clones, but then my devotion ran out on the last clone. So I need to think about how I want to address that. Um, I think Calgas is fine. I think that like if if my goal was to get like consistent kills, I think I would just use a Blood Reaver and just use like a full book or something and just chill. But like my goal is to get the fast kills. Gonna address my bad GL in the kills. Okay, have a good night. But yeah, like there is a way to be in Berserk and reflect the entire time. So like I'm trying to figure that out. I just lantern and a robe bottom. Yeah, you're kind of cracked. I'll say it. You might be a OP. We did get two kills and our Reaper is 16 kills. So that's pretty exciting. Oh, well, I need to redo my setup. Yeah, Lantern and Robottom is really nuts. What's that, a bill and drops, basically? Yeah, I think on the last phase, I need to use Limitless. I think that's the tech. Pretty good. These early phases are like really clean though. I've been enjoying these early phases. Thanks, I appreciate it. You definitely don't have to do that, but obviously I appreciate all the help that I can get. Should have used Chaos Roar for those claws. Yeah, I definitely should have Chaos Roar those claws, but it's fine. I'm gonna use Lang because I'm not confident I'll beat this in time.
The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. This damage is just so disgusting. You will break beneath me. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time. Okay, nice. Now I can just build. Okay, that was sick. That was like exactly what I, I wanted. Okay, that was sick. That was like... That was sick. That was sick. Now I just need to do that again. <laughs> Is ECB even worth it anymore other than to put in an EOF? Um, Yes, it is extremely niche though. So... If you're asking that, then no, <laughs> is basically what I would say. Like the type of person that would ask that question isn't the type of person that would be able to like use the niche where having a physical ECB is super worth it, which isn't like a slight at you. It's just, that's what it is, you know? But basically at really high levels, um, you bring an ECB switch for a uh, Ruby, bolts with greater ricochet or um hydrix bolts with greater ricochet okay that was sick that was it looked like i was a true gamer there now i seem to do it again Yeah, so at the highest level, there is a reason to have a physical ECV. But generally speaking, most people are not going to need a physical e ECV. Like, I bought a physical ECB because I'm rich and money doesn't matter. But for most people, I wouldn't recommend to them them get one. Bro, this one, this, this is the one, this is the The tide threads have split. I'll 
tear right through you. Bro, like, what is the- what did I just do to Karapak? Like, what? That was not balanced. I can contain all its power. The time threads have split. That's unfortunate. I'm not gonna get to bleed my assault here. But I guess it's fine. I'll just use regular assault and destroy. You will break yeah, that's still totally fine. Rewarning Zok with Necromancy. Nice. Look at what okay, so I hop in this body. I target this guy. BBC, and I power man, burst hop in this body. I target this guy. I do this. I do this. I do this. I limitless do this. And then devotion. Okay, that was god tier. That was like perfect. That was so good. Okay, so then I do this, do this, do this. That was like, that was so good. Now I'll just reflect because my devotion's out. I think on the real Karapak, I think I need to bleed an assault there. Thanks, Brennan, for the Prime sub. Appreciate it. Yeah, if you have any particular questions about Zuck with Necromancy, uh, just let me know. Gotta get ready for bed. Have a good rest of the stream and GL and drops. Catch you tomorrow. All right, take it easy, Nate. So these kills are going to be a little bit slower than my necromancy kills, but like, it's just, it's so much more fun. So I'm trying to think. I think. I think I bleed an assault on the last clone, but I'm not actually sure. I need to think about it.
Now, that's crazy that my Langs just did nothing. Witness the roar that was really the sad. Staff. I didn't get a single Lang stack. I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Okay, we salvaged it, but that was a little bit cringe. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. That's a lot of letters, but thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. The damage is just so, it's like, melee is so sick now. Click on this guy. Click on this guy. Power burst. Click on this guy. Wait. I just trolled. Uh, I, I just trolled. Well. Well, Chaos Roar Claws, I guess. this that was unfortunate uh yeah i'm dead i'm dead i didn't mean to berserk when i did so it threw me off and I wasn't sure how to fix it. That's one of the biggest issues I'm going to have is that I'm just not as familiar with melee. So like when I make a mistake, I'm just kind of lost. But like that's something that will get better with time, obviously. Yeah, like if I make a mistake with necromancy, like I know what happened, so I know how I'm supposed to fix it. But with, with melee, I have no idea. And obviously, that's just because I'm not familiar with the uh, style. Okay, I did not think that was in, in range, but I guess it was. My bad. I should have known.
Also, I need to find places to use this Adren Pod. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to be using this Adren Pod. I don't think I need it in, uh, maybe I can use it in phase one there. Maybe, but I'm not sure where the Adren Pod is supposed to be used. I know I can use it in phase four. And I need to be using it in phase four. Wait. Okay. I just trolled again. Yeah, I'll definitely get your best in slot necromancy first. Yeah, I mean, having Berserk up for basically the entire kill just makes the kill so fast. No, always you. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. So maybe I'll just use it here. That way I can do this. And I can just bleed this assault now. Okay, I I, I like that. That looks good. So we use that at first adrenaline pot there. The threads of time. The time threads have split. Tear right through you. This dude, this damage is so sick. Did you try Chaos Roar the more power during Dark? No. That's also something that I can do, but actually, I don't think you're supposed to Chaos Roar there because, like, you way overkill on damage. So I don't think that Chaos Roar is very good. I can contain all its power. The time threads have split. Tear right through you. You will break beneath me. Yeah, that's something I've been thinking about as well. I grab this body, I target this guy. Power burst, grab this body, target this guy. Okay. Okay, that was like perfect. Okay. Let me just bash this guy real quick. Okay, we do Langs. Chaos Roar. Seven minutes. Seven and minutes this. is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Tezo, for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, wait. Perfect. And then we, we can do this. 
We can do this. We can do this. We'll resonance. And we'll reflect. Okay, that was sick. I'm understanding. My eyes are open to the truth. So, with that kill time, I get one more adrenaline pot usage. So I need to think if there is another place where I want to use adrenaline pot. I don't think so, but we'll see. <clears throat> but yeah, I use Sea Roar during Zerks. Yeah, Chaos, Chaos Roar Langs is, is good. It just depends on how many stacks you have. That's another one of the issues that I'm having is that there's a lot of creativity with melee in your rotations because you just don't know how many Lang stacks you're going to have. So, like, there I had six Lang stacks. There's no reason for me to Chaos Roar there. And then I activated Chaos Roar, and it just didn't make any sense to because it only had uh, 37k health. So, like, I should have just used... Uh, destroy, then bled and assault on Karapak, but like, th these are the mistakes that we're going to make while we're learning, right? Okay. Um, at Karapak, yes, because Karapak is going to drop like 20 mil an hour in trash loot. Probably more than that, honestly. But at a boss like Raksha, no, you shouldn't use it there. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. a good place to start brand new pvmer um it depends on your goals i would say like what are your goals that you want to achieve with with pvm you know like if you just want to like get started and start learning your first boss god wars 2 is usually a really good place to start Raksha is also a good, good, good place to start. Look 
Okay, grab this body. Target this guy. Wait, I forgot to power burst. Hold Seven on. minutes. Seven minutes is oh, all I can spare late. to play with you. Thanks, Sirius Black, for the follow. Appreciate it. Wait, why is this happening? Okay. Oh, I understand. Okay. I understand why that keeps happening. I'm just gonna barricade. Nine HP. Jesus Christ. This dodge chance is going crazy right now. Just let me die. Let me die. I should check out some R3 content being an old school player. Yeah, I mean Obviously, there are different games, and each game has their strengths and weaknesses, but I think RS3's bosses are, like, really mechanically com complex, and I really enjoy killing a lot of them. And then there's a lot of complexity in, like, playing the game, which is pretty different from old school, I think. I thinking Raksha because of prayer switching. Raksha is a good place to practice prayer, prayer switching, um, but... Yeah, I mean, yeah, you can start with uh, Raraksha for sure. Do you play it old school at all? I've played it. I just can't. The training is too slow, and all I want to do is PK. So the old school training is just like, it's too much. I think for speed kills, you're a Grimoire locked, but like, I don't know how necessary it is. Again, I also haven't messed around at all with the melee and like your your builds, so I have no clue if like I have no clue how necessary Grim Grimoire is. It's definitely possible that you're not Grimoire locked at all, and like I just don't know. I messed up. No. But yeah, God of Wars 2 is just really good because the bosses like aren't gonna blow you up and kill you instantly for making one mistake. Yeah, I try to keep things relatively simple. Oh god, I was trolling. Yeah, I just griefed. It shouldn't matter, but that was really bad.
Okay, I don't think it's gonna matter. But yeah, there's 100% a lot going on, so I definitely understand a lot of people, like, being confused and overwhelmed. Because this can be very overwhelming, but this is also, like, extremely endgame bossing. It's the same way that, like, old school's super endgame bossing is, is overwhelming. Not to the same capacity, of course, but it's the same, like, type of thing. Wait, <laughs> I didn't think that would kill me. <laughs> I keep, I'm so used to how much damage you take in with necromancy that I totally forgot that like, oh, I'm zerked right now. I'm like actually dead. Yeah, full book is basically free to run. So because it's basically free to run, you should run it whenever you can get away with it. I just don't know when you can get away with it for, uh, for, uh, melee. Once I'm more familiar with melee, I'll have a different opinion on it, I'm sure. But just for right now, I don't have any opinions on it. They'd rather farm Zuck, for, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I normally tell players that it's not worth buying a full book if you can help it. Like, try to get one as, as a drop because the upkeep cost is so cheap. It just feels really bad. So we'll wait for Barge, Bleed Flurry, because that's all I have left. Fury, Langs. I did a lot less damage than I thought I was going to. Please die. Witness the wrong. I completely dis disagree, and I'm dead. Um, it's power. 
the time threads have split. Well, that wasn't good. I'll tear right through you. <laughs> this kill is a complete disaster. Yeah, that was just horrible. Judging by your cape, I'm assuming you're maxed. Yep. I'm almost comped, but I keep putting it off because more combat stuff keeps coming out. I'm like hardcore uh, trolling today. I don't know what's going on. Okay, well, we're playing serious now. No more games. How long does it take to max hours wise? Um, it's hard to put a number on it. No, always you. Why can't you just let it be? World God. It's also gonna depend on if you're an iron or if you're a main. If you're an iron, then it's gonna take significantly I'll longer. Right through you. I didn't know that refresh bard, so it's good to know. Damage is just so sick. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time.
Dude, that was such a sick kill. That kill was so sick. This boss is so sick. This boss is so sick. I mean, it does help that I have max gear, so that's where a lot of the it looks so easy. But yeah, I'm also like planning out all of my fights pretty meticulously, so that's why things are going the way that they're going. Not every single ability, but like 90% of my abilities like, I already know what I'm going to do for the entire fight. So that helps out a lot. Like, when there's no variance in your kills, it makes it a lot easier to get consistent kills, you know? That, okay. Well, didn't mean to do that. Are you using time warp for Zerk? Yes. So I'll try my best to explain what I'm doing in P4. It's a lot, but I will try. That's crazy that I didn't get a single Wang spec. Or a single Wang stack, rather. No, I control the threads of time. The so here I'm gonna Berserk, use any ability basically. Greater Fury, Overpower, Wang spec, Claws. Wait for Barge, Barge, Fury. Overpower, Bleed Assault. My Chaos Roar is up, so I'm going to Chaos Roar and then I'm going to Claws. You will break beneath me. And then we escape Barge. We're going to escape Barge again. And we're going to escape Barge again. And now we're just going to do literally the exact same rotation. I think I messed up. I'm actually positive I messed up. Yep, that checks out. I don't think it's going to matter. Oh, no, it matters. I don't get my, my blood assault. So I can't do the escape barge stuff because I didn't do enough damage here. So I actually need to like do like a real rotation here. Thanks Colin for the raid. I appreciate it. How did your stream go? Uh, I'm going to Claws here and hope 
that they do enough damage to save this. They didn't, so I need to... T I need to... F I don't know how I'm going to fix this. Um, let me think. I'm just going to barricade. Yeah, I'm learning melee care pack, and it's it's a lot. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play. Thanks, Colin, for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, I signed. That sucks. Uh, I should be dead here. We'll see. I might be able to fix this, but I'm almost guaranteed dead here. Maybe I can live. Oh my god, I died instantly. I don't think there's a good reason to do melee Zuck. I'm going to be completely honest. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Red Dog, for the follow. Appreciate it. Yeah, like, Melee Zuck is really, really hard, and I just don't know why you'd want to do Melee Zuck. Besides saying that you can. But yeah, I griefed my rotation really hard, and then um, I died instantly, and it wasn't good. But it's okay, because we know what we're doing this time, and we're not going to grief. Okay, I'm playing serious now. I'm locked in. No, no more games. You. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? Okay, so we destroy, walk under. Do a bleed rotation. ZGS. I will put you in your place. We barge assault. Uh Okay, that's fine. And then we'll destroy. Okay, nice. Now we're cooking. The tide threads have split. The langs and claws. Right you. We'll wait for barge. Barge fury. Um, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure. Is Cal Grimm stronger than Wen Reaver? Yeah, I... With melee, I think Cal Grimm is, like, just really insane. or claws. You will break beneath me. Uh, 
Use Langs. Okay. Look at what Click this guy. Click this guy. Power burst. Wait, I forgot to power burst. Um. Oh, that's not good. Oh well. We wait for G barge. We barge this guy. Build adrenaline. I'm dying. I'm dying in a fire. Well, that was really bad. <laughs> I was hoping I wouldn't get comboed by them both there, but I did. So that's not good. Uh, so I'm just gonna build adrenaline now. I'm probably gonna have to barricade here to save this. So we'll just cade here. And we'll use our defensives. And then overpower should just kill here. Okay, nice. Okay, that P4 was almost good, and then I trolled and ruined the game. So, don't don't do that. My aura's off, so let's turn the aura back on. Put darkness on. I keep forgetting to put darkness on, and it's killing me like every time. I'm so much less survivable when like my darkness is off. No, always you. Why can't you just let it be? Guardian. I'll tear right through the walk under with a melee is just so much simpler now, which is really nice as well. Like you can't mess it up because your channels will still cast while you're walking under. for barge oops I forgot to use claw spec okay we'll we'll cause okay I messed up so this isn't like unfixable I just took a little bit more damage than I was expecting
Okay, we'll bleed destroy because that's all we have. And a little chaos or a claws. Big damage. You will break beneath me. Yeah, melee's burst is a little insane. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time. We'll barge this guy. Do this. Oh, wait. My devotion's on cooldown. Oh, I see. Well, I'm just down. Yep. That, that checks out. <laughs> That's... <laughs> oh, man. That was hot. Yeah. Don't do that. Well, so melee isn't the warrior class, and I think that's the thing that's hard for a lot of people to kind of get, is that melee is the assassin class. Okay, take it easy, Sam. But yeah, like, if you look at melee as the assassin class, it makes a lot more sense why things are the way they are. Doesn't mean it's necessarily balanced, mind you, but it just it makes sense why things are the way they are. Where melee just has like this crazy burst window, and then that's where your assassination window is. But yeah, yeah, then magic is the it's more akin to the warrior class, I guess. I'm going to lose a lot of my Zark timer here, which is unfortunate. No, always you. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Iron Ant, for the follow. Appreciate it. No, I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Okay, wait for barge. Bleed assault. Chaos roar. Claws. And we just keep escape barging. I can contain all its power. That's my favorite interaction in this, I think, is the escape barge. It just looks so sick. I'll tear right through you. 
Oh wait, my barge is on cooldown. Well, that's not good. How did that happen? Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Mando, for the follow. Appreciate it. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, RS2 Legend, for the follow. Appreciate it. Um, I'm actually not sure what I'm supposed to do. I guess I'll overpower and then hope my claws crit. Okay, that helped. Now my adrenaline is like ruined, but that definitely helped. Oh, my legs are on cooldown. I didn't even realize that. I will do this and overpower. Okay, well, that was horrible. <laughs> that was so bad. Oh, man. What would you recommend, Revolution or Full Manual? Um, There are advantages to Full Manual in every style, so it's just a matter of whether or not you personally will take advantage of those advantages. So, for instance, if you're using magic and you're not going to Fortic, you gain nothing from playing on full manual other than your inputs are more consistent right like that is an advantage in itself but like i'm manually pressing a lot of my abilities so even though i'm on revolution doesn't matter as much not not really you know Generally, Re Revolution is really good if you have a lot of filler abilities. Why can't you just let where the exact ability you're using doesn't matter as much. You just need to be using literally anything. That's when Revolution is going to be at its best. I'll tear right through you. Nice, I'm glad to hear it. No, I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare I'll to play with you. Right Thanks, Tom Ender, for the follow. Appreciate it. Up. Oopsies. The 
Time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. I'm just gonna wait the extra time for my barge. I think that's wrong, but I already did it, so. Yeah, it turns out it didn't matter because I just exploded Carapac. Okay, take it easy, John. That was so greedy what I just did. You fractured the threads of time. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. Hmm. Does it matter, though? I don't think it matters. We got the kill, so that's that's good. More kills are more better. Just let me die. Let me die. Yeah, luckily with melee's burst, you just don't have to do that, which is really crazy. Like blowing all like getting all of them low is definitely an option for like all of the styles. But melee just does so much damage, you just don't have to do that, which is really nice. Okay, take it easy. I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Oh, I just trolled really hard. I will put you in your place. Um, zerking at the crystal is a little bit more damage, but it is more damage, you know? 
So it's worth considering for sure. Well, not a, a little bit. It's probably close to like 50,000 extra damage. That's pretty meaningful, I'd say. So that's the main reason that I do it. Jesus, I didn't even get to Zerk. I just got blown up. Nice. Holy. I'm sure at some point I'll get this to be pretty consistent, but for now I'm just kind of briefing. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Gary, for the follow. Appreciate it. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Doom, for the follow. But yeah, I guess I can do like a few entries just to show the uh, big, big difference. Um, you, you'll, you'll feel the Zerk a lot more at a boss like Raksha. So we'll just re retune this to Raksha. Like, you'll feel it a lot more here because you get more time to actually use it. I'm not going to do the entire kill. I'm just going to uh, do the entry and show the big difference. Um, let me put on my Raksha build really quick. Okay, so we Dragon Battle Axe. And then Zerk.
So, like, that's not a meaningless amount of damage, right? Like, I messed up by one tick, but if I didn't make that mistake, we would have uh, phased it before uh, Tailspin. So now if you just Dragon Battle Axe, it's just a little bit less consistent. So I was getting really crazy crits there, and it just happened to work off, or it happened to work out. But if you don't get, like, the super insane crits, then that just fails, and it feels really bad. Plus, during the beginning of Rockfall, you kind of want to take it a little bit slower. So in my opinion, it's just better to do the Zerg at, at the Crystal, but ultimately, it's up to you. Like... It's not a big enough difference that it's like, oh, Zerking is like you're saving, you know, 30 seconds if you do it at the crystal versus not doing it at the crystal. At least at a boss like, well, like Raksha. But at Karapak, where you need to save as much time as you can to dodge the triple lightning, it's pretty meaningful to get, you know, 50,000 extra damage. And again, I messed up the first kill, or the first example, and it was still more more damage, so. That's also worth keeping in mind as well. That's unfortunate. Of the staff. I can contain all its power. The time threads have split. That's very unfortunate. I'll tear right through you. I did not think I was going to get hit by that, but I did, so now this is just really bad. You will break beneath me. So I think the fix here is to try to get another easy K spec.
I don't think I can burst him again without Zerking. Yeah, you still get the extra time off by uh, bleeding a fury. Witness the raw power of the staff. Which is really nice. It's very, very nice that you get to do that. Yeah, I didn't think the last tick, or I didn't think the lightning wall would have hit me that last time. Nice, that's awesome, Brennan. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Nopers, for the follow. Appreciate it. Okay. I'm locked in. We're going to go crazy this guy. I can feel it. Always you. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. here now we just destroy I will put you in your place I have to use Lang Spec. I, can contain all I didn't want to use my Lang Spec, but I had to use it. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. I only have tier 95 necro gear. Where should I go for ruination? Is ruination the tier 99? Or is that the tier 95 prayer? I don't actually remember. Uh, you should not be going for a tier 99 prayer basically at, at all. Tier 99 prayer is the absolute last thing that you, you want. You fractured the threads of time. I'm gonna die. 
Maybe. Maybe I'll be fine. I'm pretty sure I'm dead, though. Maybe Carapac will just be a Chad and keep missing? Nope, he won't. Oopsies! Free. Yeah, getting the tier 95 gear first is going to be really important. So I'm trying to think, why did that go the way it did? I mess up the devotion, but my devotion wasn't late. Or it, it was late, which means I, I time warped early. So I was one tick too early on my time warp. Interesting. You prefer a Calg or a Ripper at Raksha? Um, generally Ripper Demon. Right now I've only tested it with Calgarian Demon. So you get the tier 95 curse from being level 95 prayer. Like that's how you get it is just having level 95 prayer. Okay, surely we, we got to kill this time. Surely. No, always you. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? Oh, that's what you were asking. Um, yeah, he doesn't turn off your damage prayer. I will put you in your place. I have so many lang stacks. This is actually so so much damage. No, I control the threads of time. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. I shouldn't have used that last barge. That was like pretty dumb. The tide threads have split. I'll tear right through you. I'll just wait. Whatever. How'd you make your first billion? Um, tormented demons.
Yeah, melee is really sick. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time. Dude, I keep signing and it's like so cringe. I'm actually dead here. Yeah, I'm a hundred percent dead here. Yep. God. I guess I'm just supposed to reactivate um, Devotion like the instant it runs out. Like I, I can't re-Zerk and then re-Devotion. I just need to instantly Devotion as soon as it runs out. And then build up the Zerk. Okay, I understand. Yeah, Melee is sick though. Like Melee is really, really cool. But yeah, when I was farming Claws, it, they were like 20, or when I was farming uh, limbs, limbs were like 20 mil a piece. So I would just AFK that for like hours. I probably just need to sleep on the P4 and just like let it sink in. I definitely need a Langs back here. Nice. No, I control the okay. threads of time. The time threads have split. Favorite anime? Um, right that's a good question. Spice and Wolf is up there. Uh, so my top two are for sure um, Spice and Wolf and Garden of Sinners. Outside of those two, like the rest of my top five, top ten is pretty up in the air. Like, if you ask me today, my answer might be different tomorrow, so... But yeah, those are my top two for sure. I can contain all its power. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. I've never seen Hunter Hunter, but I don't really care for Shonen in all honesty. There are very few shonen that I like actually enjoy. 
Ah, uh, that clause is bad. I did it take late. I'm, I'm feeling it. This is the one. Look at what you've done. You fractured the threads of time. Okay, so now I can Zerk, Devotion, Claws. Oh, that Claws is a little suspect. So we'll click this guy. We'll Barge, and we'll sign into him. There we go. Just what the doctor ordered. I'm just gonna barricade. It's safe. The claws against the last clone was like, that was fake. I shouldn't have done that. That was like really fake. I'm dead. And there it is. But yeah, claws against the last, uh, against the last clone. I shouldn't have done that because it burned all my adrenaline, and then I couldn't just kill Carapac. Uh, I have them with necromancy on my channel. I don't have anything uh, super like I don't have anything for for melee. I'm just really bad at upkeeping my uh, darkness. Like I'm really really bad at upkeeping my my, my darkness here. I hundred percent should be using darkness. If you're talking about for Vorkath, that's just... It, it happens. Like, my spike drop rate is 1 in 11. And I know someone whose is like 1 in 120. No. And it's like, that's just Always what it is. You. Why can't you just let it be, World Guardian? I'll tear right through you. Yeah, see, problem solved. It's the ultimate technique. You complain, and then all of your problems, they just go away. I will put you in your place. True. Yeah, complaining is only uh, OP in RuneScape. It's uh, super annoying in real life. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. Oh, that's so bad. That is really bad. I don't know what I'm going to do about that. I will put you in your place. Yeah. 
Maybe I can do this. And then this. And then this. And then claws again. I can contain all its power. Okay, so now I'll go here. I thought that would hit the time thread. The fact that it didn't is like really, really bad. I will put you in your place. Yeah, I don't know how to fix this. Well, okay, so I, I have to barricade is how I, I fix it. Okay, well, I can't barricade anymore, so... Oh, I should be able to, actually. But I have no food for the last phase, so I don't really know. I think this one's done, but we'll see. Witness the raw power of the staff. I didn't even see that one. I'll tear right through you. Yeah, that checks out. I like super messed up. Yeah, Car Carapax music is like the best in in the game, I think. Yeah, I made too many mistakes in a, in a row and just died. Oopsies. Don't do that. Okay. You have darkness on. Um Yeah, the music, yeah, that, uh, the music I was listening to in the arena, that was Carapax Ball's music. No. Yeah, Carapax Ball's music is really nuts. Yeah, Zox is also very good. I enjoy Zox music a lot. Oh my god, it happened again. That's so cringe. The dead clicking is like ultra annoying. Seven minutes. 
Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Thanks, Wrath of Zay, for the follow. Appreciate it. I can contain all its power. The time threads have split. I'll tear right through you. So we're gonna have to barricade this, but that's fine. think we're good now. I'm dead. Your timeline. Yeah, I needed to survive one more ability and then I would have been fine. Take it easy, Silver. I can't get get past I can't get past Kiln for my Necro Cape. Uh what level of necromancy are, are you? Cause it's gonna be extremely challenging until you're like 70. Then once you're 70, it's pretty straightforward. Until you get your Death Guard spec, it's like really hard um okay i need to like sleep on this because this is starting to get pretty frustrating so that's where i'm gonna end it for today um let's raid out let's see who's seven on one minutes seven minutes is all i can spare to play with you thanks archreal for the follow appreciate it all right let's see who's online and we'll give them a raid Okay, so no one I know is online, so let's just see. That's really loud. Let's turn that off. Um. I don't know any of these people. Oh, let's raid this panda guy, actually. I think I've raided him before. All right. Yeah, we're going to raid uh, Pan Panda Force. I will see you guys tomorrow. Take it easy.